Hi, this is Yelly from Elisa Arbel Stickers and I am super excited because this is my first time designing for a planner that is not Erin Condren. Well, yeah, I did some happy planner at one time, but um, yeah, I'm excited. So I'm gonna show you all my Hobonichi Cousin kits and uh, mostly the format is what I want you to see. Um, I wanna start with the monthly and let me explain something about the monthly. So typically what you would do is in order to make this flexible, you know, I'm all about flexibility. So this is what's going to cover the monthly and then you will add one of these scripts. So this is a, a sold separate sheet and I made sure that the scripts fit here. That way you can have your monthly for any week, like any month you want. So let's say you wanna use this one in March. It's not gonna say April over here, so you can put the March sticker on it and make it yours. So that was my idea. Let me explain a little bit of what's included. So this is a one strip um, that's gonna cover your days of the week for your monthly in your Hobonichi. Oh, so these are A5 Hobonichi Cousin kits. Um, I'll, I'm not sure how fast or, or if I will be adding any other Hobonichi um, planner kits, but for now, Hobonichi A5, because the next one I'm gonna do is the Plum A5 Vertical. Uh, so, that's the next uh, planner I'm gonna add to the lineup, but for now, let's do Hobonichi. So then this here, as you can see, these are two stickers. So you have the header and you have the box. The idea with these is that you can use this header or interchange it, and then you have a box where you can just add um, some dots and maybe um, write your to-dos for next month, this month, or important trackers, highlights, whatever you wanna do. So I also have three monthly trackers and they have five weeks each day of the week. And uh, then over here, you write what you're tracking. So the idea with these is that um, if the month starts on a Wednesday, then you start on a Wednesday too. Uh, it's very hard to add the numbers, so it has to be a grid like this. I, I can't add the numbers, otherwise it just won't fit in the planner. And this is, uh, the idea is for these to be used on the sidebar. And then you have some labels. You have a lot of small ones and a few large ones. The reason why you have a lot of small ones is because the Hobonichi planner doesn't have like huge boxes. So in order for you to fit a few, I did the smaller ones. Um, however, if you need to write a lot in it or if it's like a big appointment or you're blocking off the day, then you also have some big ones to work with. Then um, you have washi, which uh, I know some people like to use it, others don't. And uh, you also just have uh, these like headers without anything on them because if you'd like to order custom scripts, you can totally do that and make them your own if you don't use any of the ones that I have, like next month, this month, important trackers, highlights. You think of something else, like you wanna keep track of bills to pay or whatever, so you can totally um, get a custom script and fill it in here. Then um, some fun icons, and of course there's a whole bunch of um, dots but some fun icons that you might need in a month which are bills to pay birthday well the balloons right um payday some people get paid weekly other people get paid twice a week some once a month so this covers everybody stickers especially from our shop so if you want to um put down when we have releases um credit cards then you have some flags a little sticky note, and then the no school icons. So this is, um, I, 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 I went ahead and uh, ordered a Hobonichi planner. So as soon as it gets here, I'll make sure to um, 
do like a plan with me for April just so that you guys can see how this lays on the planner but I did do it on some photocopies I wish I had them here uh, I guess I'll have to go um, look for them but anyway so um, let me show you the patterns first so we have kit 107 so I have April and May kits uh, that are going to be available in the shop so 108 I did not do the um, Easter one uh, just because of time constraints but okay I'm gonna continue so 110 111 which is a celebration birthday kit then 112 which is the Mother's Day kit 113 114 this is this has to be my favorite one of uh, the May kits I really like this pattern and then the Memorial Day flowers they pay patriotic flowers that you can use either for Memorial Day or any other patriotic holiday or um, I mean including 4th of July okay and this is showing you how they fit like uh, one of you guys that really wanted uh, me to work with this you guys sent me some sheets of your planner I made extra copies just to be able to work on them and kind of try so um, these are not really the final version but I only made a few changes and no changes in sizing really so this is kind of what you get and you're able to plan the full month so like the changes that I did was uh, that I had made these boxes like too big and without the white inside, but you only really need one box to block the month over here. So this is where your month script would go. So for example, if I wanted um, to say that this is my March, I would just go ahead and add my March here. Sometimes you could add it like diagonally to, it's completely up to you, um, but I think the Hobonichi Planner has it this way. So that's the way you would add the sticker. So anyway, um, <laughs> sorry for the ugly photocopies. Uh, like I said, when the planner gets here, I'll, I'll do a plan with me. But the important thing for me, and thank you, um, like for, for you guys sending me the, the sheets, is that I can definitely work and... Uh, figure out a way uh, to kind of design the stickers and I liked it so much that I got myself one of these planners so most likely I don't know if I'm going to get any Erin Condren planners this year but I will for sure get that Hobonichi one okay so now let's continue to the weekly let me show you kind of how the stickers lay just so that you can get an idea. And I did have a whole bunch of stickers left. I don't even know what page it was because you don't have these many. <laughs> this is just that the first ones were a little too big. So I tried a second time. So I tried a third time until I was comfortable with the size or this is second, this is third. I don't remember, but um, I, I tried a few times uh, just so that, you know, but yeah, like you can do a lot. And I just wanted to show you how the week kind of, um, place and now let me show you the design um uh, i don't think i'm gonna go and show you each one of the kits i might if you want to see it i don't know so um you have two pages you don't have to get them both if you don't like do a lot of stickers and stuff like this one is the one that has the headers and it has the box says and it has some washi and it has the sidebar but if that's not your thing i sell the headers separately and as you can see over here the headers are not a continuous strip you have to peel each of them out and i made it on purpose so that you have some little white space because like the hobonichi planner does not fully um go up until over here so here it is and um yeah so if you don't like this sheet you can totally just buy the strips in this sheet if you're more uh, uh used to just using this type of uh boxes so completely up to you depending on what you want or just get both and an extra 
strip of date covers and make it go further for a couple of weeks. It all depends on your planning style. Uh, for me, I would be using both for just the one week because I typically do use all the um, items, uh, but you know, up to you, whatever you wanna do. So let's just show you um, all the other kits that are available as of right now. So we also have 108, which is um, the plum butterflies. Then we have kit 110, which is the purplicious, and this one also has some butterflies. Then we have kit 111, which is a celebration kit or birthday kit. And we have 112. Oh gosh, my hands are so dry that I can't really pick these up. 113. One fourteen. So um, also this one has like some more cute elements. You have the scallop boxes, you have the bow dividers. I'm gonna have to keep this one. There's a little bit of a tiny smudge. I don't know if that was me. Okay, so um, bow dividers and such, and then you have some little icons and you have some little circles, but you also have uh, some kind of like tiny, tiny stars. So yeah, I I wasn't quite sure if my F mark was going to cut these well. So just be careful while um, pulling them out because it's not an easy thing for the cutter to cut them. And I don't know if I'm going to continue offering them, but for now they're here. I'll have to try and see how well they come off because you see these come off nicely, but for these, I feel that um, it's a little bit difficult to take them out. So I might just either make them a little bit bigger or just do um, dots over here for the rest. And and that's the thing, I, I will be making some changes. It's not gonna be huge changes, but there will be some changes because as I plan with these formats, I might see that, well, it's better to do this or that. But for now, I, I think I got a pretty good hang on it. I watched a whole bunch of YouTube videos of people that used Hobonichi. Um, I also avoided looking at other shops because I don't want to replicate whatever they have, but I also wanted to make this mine and offer you guys stickers in the Elisa Ravel sticker style which you've come to appreciate. And that's why some of you are super happy that we're offering Hobonichi now because you're switching to Hobonichi and you didn't want to stop buying from the shop. So there you go. Um, I might switch to Hobonichi too with you guys. So we'll see. <laughs> anyway, here they are. Thank you so very much for watching. Uh, let me know in the comments down below which one is your favorite. And uh, I'm excited. You, you can go to www.elisaravel.com to get these. And there's gonna be, that's Etsy. And there's a section for A5 Hobonichi Cousin Kits. And you can find um, the extra date headers uh, is in the listing with the kit, but this one is a separate listing because you would only buy one of these per year. Um, unless you have more than one Hobonichi planner and you wanna buy more than that. but you only really need one of these per year because you're, well, this is not even the monthly, but anyway, um, you would be using it in the monthly. Thank you again. I hope you are excited as I am for these kids. And yeah, take care. Have a wonderful rest of your week. Bye guys.